The following message has been approved by the Arcturian High Council. Greetings, fellow humans, starseeds, and those of you who have not yet figured out who or what you are. My name is Prince Ian of Arcturus, and I have come to save your world. There may be some of you who are asking yourselves, I didn't know the world needed saving, and who is this bozo anyway? Which reminds me of your Carl Sagan, the famous American cosmologist and astrophysicist. The fact that some geniuses were laughed at does not imply that all who are laughed at are geniuses. They laughed at Columbus. They laughed at Fulton. They laughed at the Wright brothers. But they also laughed at Bozo the Clown. Yes, all true. But what I am about to tell you is no laughing matter. There are a group of evil beings known as the reptiles who have invaded your planet. And to be clear, for those of you of inferior intelligence with a severely limited imagination, I am not referring to Godzilla, Puff the Magic Dragon, or your slimy mother-in-law. Many eons ago, in galaxies far, far away, a race of beings known as the reptiles came to Earth and merged their DNA with the DNA of your dinosaur ancestors. The result was the beginning of a highly aggressive species known as the Draconian Reptiles. Their purpose in coming here was to create a new race of super beings, making them some of the most powerful and feared creatures in the multiverse. Once they achieved their nefarious purpose, they left Earth before the end of the fifth extinction event on this planet. And contrary to popular belief, it was not an asteroid that destroyed 97% of life on this planet 60 million years ago. It was rapidly increasing carbon dioxide and climate change. The reptiles went on to begin the Orion Wars eons ago, where they invaded star system after star system, leaving only death and destruction behind, as they sucked the resources out of every planetary system until nothing was left on that planet to support life. They are now here on your planet to dominate your species and take control of your precious resources. Unless you take decisive action, your world will be destroyed. This fate has happened to many civilizations across time and space during the past several centuries. It was the fate of the Pleiadians, Syrians, Alpha Centurians, Lyrians, Andromedans, Anunnaki, and my people, the Arcturians. This will be the fate of the human race if your people do not stand up to the power-grabbing, evil, materialistic, racist, ignorant, egotistical, misogynistic, greedy, xenophobic reptiles that have achieved top positions in your government and industry that are driving your people into full-blown extinction. Let me show you an image of the planet Proxima Centauri b commonly called Arcturus, in the Alpha Centauri star system before the reptilian invasion. The beings on Proxima Centauri b had been living together in harmony for millions of years. Now look at the picture on the right side of your screen. This was our home planet before and after the reptilian invasion. To sum up, the reptilians are here to extinguish life on this planet and steal your resources. They have already started to weaken you by exposing millions of you to brain-invasive spirochetes. They are also interfering with your human reproductive abilities and decreasing the numbers of your species by dumping millions of tons of toxic chemicals into the environment every year. Your scientists have documented some of the worst effects. Autism, ADHD, allergies and asthma, dementia, lower IQ, cancer, and infertility. Some of these chemicals would interfere with men being able to make love to their women. Yes, that is a big problem for some of you. And to make matters worse, men's sperm counts have dropped to two-thirds of what they were 50 years ago due to these chemicals, and most are now damaged. And in this case, two heads are not better than one. Yes. As a 13th level, Arcturian Master Healer, I will do my best to heal your planet, but be clear. Your climate emergency requires immediate and decisive action. The reptiles will try and convince you 
that fossil fuels are necessary for your survival. This is a lie. Their carbon pollution has led to a significant increase in your planetary temperature, resulting in worsening forest fires, hurricanes, storm surges, severe droughts, heat waves, dwindling glaciers, and ice flows with sea level rise, not to mention an increase in vector-borne and waterborne disease. These changes will lead to significant loss of potable water and food from pollution, not to mention the loss of coffee and chocolate, which for some of you may be even worse. Yes, of course. The biodiversity of your planet is dwindling, and you are dying as a species. You are now in the early stages of your sixth extinction. Please wake up, humans and starseeds. Your awakening is our only hope. We must come together now and work to defeat the reptiles and their evil plans. And the good news, we the Arcturians are your friends. There are solutions. I have put them in a book called Starseed Revolution, The Awakening. Reptiles would believe this is a science fiction novel, but nothing could be further from the truth. So have hope. Now that the US government has finally declassified our existence on your planet in the year 2021, I am finally revealing my true self to your civilization so I can share our Arcturian ideas and solutions to save your planet. I wish you all peace and love. Intergalactic messages would be forthcoming in my book. In love, be love, do love. Prince Ian of Arcturus, the Royal PIA. Available at Barnes & Noble, Amazon.com, and all local bookstores. Unless the reptiles destroy all available copies. Get yours now! Yeah.